Why is Chelsea's silver sweater naked at the romance festival? Chelsea, put some clothes on. Hey everybody, it's Kelsey and PJK, AKA Kelsey Dangerous, back with another Sims 4 video. Today we are back in the not so very challenge. It's a challenge in the Sims 4 where you have 10 generations of Sim and for each generation, they're themed to a different color and have specific requirements for each generation. If you would like to see what those requirements are, the link to the challenge is in the description below. Currently, we are on the first generation, which is Mint, and her requirements that we're working on are Chief of Mischief and the Scientist career, along with some other ones, which you can check out below. Last time, Mint was looking for love and friendship. We had downloaded some of your guys' sims that you had created for my playthrough, and then chaos ensued. Things got dramatic. <laughs> I haven't been able to see your guys' comments from episode three yet because I'm filming episode four before three goes up. So I decided that while waiting to see what you guys kind of think, this episode will be focusing on friendships. We'll still maybe see both of the guys. Maybe we'll go on dates with each of them. I don't know, who's to say? It's not like it's my video or anything and I can do whatever I want. I'm still going to wait to see what you guys think after episode three before I make a final call on who Mint should pursue. But mostly I really want Mint to have a strong group of close friends. So the way Mint is described in the challenge is that she's career driven, but still makes time for silly pranks and outings with her closest friends. And right now Mint doesn't have friends. She has like one friend. If you're new and you're enjoying this challenge, make sure to give us a thumbs up for this video. Comment below any ideas that you have for the challenge. And also if you aren't already, make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on that notification bell so you're notified every time a new video goes live. I put up a new video every Wednesday and every Saturday. It's berry time, baby. So right now we are at Chief of Mischief three of four. So we just have this left. And then we are also at level four of the scientist career out of 10 and then our other thing that we need to get done for this challenge is complete the elements collection. And as you can see here, we're only two away. So we're blowing through the first part of this challenge. I think the thing that'll take the longest will be of course um, her career. Also, she has to master the mischief and logic skills. And as we can see here, mischief and logic, we're about halfway through that. So we're probably about halfway through um, phase one. Okay, Mint is at work. Her goals for today at work, gossip about coworkers with Paka Uha, and we have to tell Paco all about how we crush it hard on Raphael. Here's our crush. He's typing away, but he's kind of like a bad boy. Oh, look at his green eyes though. Perfect for mint generation. Firstly, we got to friendship wise, we got to gossip. And then I think we'll also ask for, since we're so close to finishing crystals, ask for a crystal. And then we need to tinker with the coffee maker and invent the hover lamp. She's just first saying hi to Renee. Paco's coming to us. Whoa, with the sassiest walk. Oh, he did give us one. Wait, did we not gossip with him? First thing on the list of things to do when you get into work, gossip with your coworker. Okay, we did it. Boom. And also Paka is now one of our closest friends. Look, it's Paka, then Raphael, then Hazel, and the invention inverter who, you know, was our first friend. Okay, let's invent the hover lamp. He's like, oh, you bad girl. You got a crush on Raphael. Didn't he just hook up with his roommate? She's like, don't tell me. I thought they might not be into each other, but then she kind of kept staring at me at my party. So it's all weird. Although Mint is a little jealous. I could see her kind of being like a little competitive for someone that she's interested in. But at the end of the day, I don't want her to steal no one else's person. Not that you can ever steal a person technically. Like people are gonna go where they wanna go and can make their own decisions. I'm just saying, put it all together. And what do you get? She's like, um, and you need to shoot it right there and right there, invention constructor. Ooh, they did a little high five. Look at that. I wanna put it in our inventory. We'll look at that later. She also wants to have a water balloon fight. Oh my gosh, how cute is that? Okay, we're gonna save that. Maybe she'll invite people over and they'll have like a little summer day. Now she's gonna go mix a snake oil serum and then we'll probably analyze. Let's do starter flowers. Hopefully there's like a rose in it and then we can also have the roses. Mint has successfully created a serum and then we need to drink or give away the serum. Well, I've got a job for you, Liza Pancakes. Yep, we're gonna test it on Eliza Pancakes. 
She's analyzing in there. That's where the flower went. It's pretty intense, honestly. My little nerdy queen. She's so focused on work. Ooh, yay! Okay, and she's gonna give away that snake oil serum and then she's going to experiment on the chemistry lab. Oh, <laughs> Pakaua is like, I see you, girl. She's like, okay, bottoms up. Eliza, what's wrong? Anything? No. <laughs> okay, she looks fine. Invent the satellite dish. Oh yeah, we're gonna invent a satellite dish. Oh, we need any common metal and any common crystal. So we need three crystals and three metals in order to do that. Hazel, can you give me another DNA sample? Okay. Also ask for a crystal and a metal from Hazel as well. Oh, she gave us some eutranium and we got the DNA sample. Yes. Okay, we need to analyze a crystal. We'll analyze amethyst. I I think we already have amethyst in our collection. Ooh, she gave us a crystal. It's called Jet. It's a black one. Apparently it's rare. I hope it's one of the ones we're needing. We got a couple lifestyles in progress. Sedentary? Rude. Close knit. That one's cute. I like close knit. Single and loving it. No. Workaholic in progress. Okay, that one's fine. We can't be single and loving it. Mint's gotta go on a couple dates. That's what has got to happen. Because she wants to find love. That's what she wants. She's so hungry and I'm not letting her eat. I'm like, nope, you can eat when work is done. You forgot to eat. She's been eating all day. That's the worst when you're really uncomfortable. Eliza, you look like you need to start gardening. Look at these plants. They need tended to. We still got like two hours of the work day. We're crushing this. All right, we're going to ask our bestie for some more crystals and metals. I don't think we'll have enough time to finish the satellite dish, but at least we'll have them. We got two crystals. Ooh, we got a lot of crystals. Oh, Mint did a fantastic job today. It won't be long before academic prestige and scientific achievements arrive. We did okay. We didn't do amazing. There's no door to the backyard. I could extend this like one and then push things over and then make a little back door here. And then we'll grab one of these doors again, the little back door. Great, yeah. And then we'll grab these stairs. Cute. So it comes down here. Could we get like a water balloon bucket? Get it in green so she can have a little water balloon fight. Now that I'm looking at it, I think we really need to put some like trees and stuff back here. Okay, so she needs to use the restroom. It's a Wednesday night. Oh my gosh, and just Hazel appeared out of nowhere. I don't know if she's got a key. She doesn't. All right, we'll let her in. She says, hey, I got a special gift for you because you're such a good neighbor and I appreciate your kindness and friendship. Want to see what it is. Oh my gosh, how cute. Also. Some of you guys recommended that I take photos of each of the um, generations and then put them on the wall. I think that would be so cute. So we're gonna do that sometime today too. You know that I'm pretty much done with what I wanted to do here, but do you mind if I hang out for a bit? How has your day been? Oh, thanks Hazel. Oh, cute. She gave us a little horse sculpture. I don't know if Minth has horse girl energy, but I know that Hazel definitely has horse girl energy. Why don't you guys play together since you're sitting at this anyway? They're both so bored. Oh, come on, girls. I need you to hurry up and get to logic level six, please. Apparently they did it and they were both bored the whole time. We'll add maybe the hover lamp over in the room. Oh my gosh, it makes the room minty. Wait, this is so cute. Wait, we can make it like a minty green. Oh yeah, you know it's a mint green room now. How cute is that? Oh, Hazel's like, that was a boring hangout. She like hardly even said goodbye as she walked out. She's a little bored. Why don't we get up to some mischief? Who should we make hate us the most? Eliza Pancakes weirdly loves us, but let's make Bob dislike us. And we're going to send a chain letter to Mortimer Goth, and then we'll do it to Bob again. We're gonna just keep doing that because that gets our mischief skill up. Yeah, we did it. Oh, he did not like it though. <laughs> her mischief is like hardly going up. It's going up a little bit, but not much. I really want her to finish the logic tonight though. So let's just get her to finish her logic skill. Okay, there we go. Oh, now she's focused. It took you this long to get focused? Lifestyle gain? Oh no, she unlocked this sedentary lifestyle. No, I hate it. Thinks I hate it. I don't want her to be sedentary. Oh, it's TZ season premiere night. Maybe she should invite some friends over after work to watch the TV premiere. Oh, today's mail has been delivered. Do you think it could possibly be? Yes, oh my gosh, we got so many elements. Not that, it's not that. Nope, no, no, no. No! At least 
least we're gaining some money from it. Let's get her be like here and then we'll do the background. Yes, perfect. And then I want you to take a selfie. There we go. I love that she's looking into the lens here, but technically I'm the lens. That doesn't make much sense, but it's all good. I hopefully one of those will be really good. Let's see. Normal, 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 normal. So actually most of them were really good. I think we'll do this one and then we will add a frame, maybe like a blue frame. Oh, that's cute. It goes with that house. This is gen one, boom. And we'll have all the gens at some point in there. All right, let's join. Well, we gotta complain about work to Paka. So where's Paka? Every, every morning, that's what we do is talk to Paka. So we're going to complain about work. And then we gotta work on the rocket for 10 minutes today. But I also feel like we should talk to Raphael. Just, you know, have a little chat. Coworker to coworker. She's like, ugh, ping pong things. I don't know why she's complaining about that. Spoil latest episode for a coworker. Oh, I don't wanna do that to anyone I like. Okay, what, we're gonna spoil an episode for Eliza. I'm so sorry, Eliza. I would never do this in real life, but Mint is very sassy. So maybe she didn't do it on purpose. I feel like she wouldn't do it this on purpose. I feel like she would do it fully on accident. Go spoil an episode for Eliza. She's Eliza, did you hear? There are frogs in the new episode of Game of Thrones. Eliza's like, what? Okay, we're not doing that anymore. You know what? I'm gonna work on my rocket, okay? I'm gonna keep my head down. I don't wanna be a jerk. Ask a coworker for a crystal. Why, perfect. It just so happens our coworker over here, Raphael. Excuse me, Raphael. Do you have to have a crystal? Look at her. She's eyeing her prey. She's feeling like sassy, a little nervous. Okay, maybe the nervousness is actually that she needs to pee. Oh my gosh. That was very sweet. They gave each other like a hello. Oh my gosh, the attractiveness alert is back. Wow, what a sim. Mint Berry just stopped what they were thinking about for a moment and found themselves staring at Raphael Williamson. Ah, Mint! It happens literally every time she sees him. She's like, <gasps> <laughs> Look, like even down here, it's like, oh, breathtaking encounter. Oh my gosh, Paka is coming over like, girl, what are you doing? Are you talking to him? I gotta be in on this. <laughs> Did he realize that she caught him the last time? Did he like just find out recently? Paka's being playful. He's like, oh, <laughs> I got you guys talking. Mint is like, quiet, Paka. I'm uncomfortable, I need to pee. I don't know why he was so embarrassed in front of us, but my guess is that maybe he didn't realize that he hooked up in, in, with a girl in a closet while we were there, and now he's just putting two and two together. Oh my gosh, he went into like a room alone. He doesn't even wanna be around anyone. Oh my gosh. Go ask about her day. She's like, how is your day, Sapria? Write up research on the computer. Well, there's no computers available, so I guess we'll just kick someone off a computer. Renee, do you mind if we borrow the computer? Okay, we gotta write up some research. Renee, can you get off please? Thank you, Renee! Technically, we're her superior, so she kinda had to, but... <laughs> Renee's just staying there like, I don't know what to do now. <laughs> discuss work with Eliza Pancake. Let's go get Eliza and discuss work with her. See, now we're being nice. I feel like she was about to slip into something a little bit more on the evil side of being a scientist. And then she realized, oh no, that's not me. That's not me. She's a good scientist. So she's gonna go chat with Eliza, try to maybe like cool things down. Of course, Paka uh, is always here. He's just such a gossip. He hardly does any work. I love him. <laughs> Eliza's like, thanks for asking. Oh my gosh. See, the game itself is like, you have to have a deep conversation with Raphael. Maybe she has to be like, listen, Raphael, I did see you, but like, don't worry about it. Like maybe they talk about their relationship. She needs to ask him some stuff. I don't think Vint would get into anything on a professional during work hours, at least not right now. <laughs> deep conversation, please. Hey, what's up? She finds it so attractive. This is so funny. He's like, what, girl? Well, of course you have to ask him for a medal. I don't think they've really flirted. They might've flirted a little bit in the last episode, but not like a ton. She wants to hug someone. I want to let her hug someone. They're friends. You can hug people at your workplace if they approve of that, you know? I mean, no one's around, but you know. Daddy, love 
loved it. And then he immediately ran away. Okay, rude. Uh, but she's happy. You create tainted serums. You must first test a normal serum three times on your own sim or others. So we've done snake oil. So why don't we do that then? So she's gonna start with the serum and then she's gonna test it again on someone else. And she's gonna do one more and then she's gonna test them twice and then hopefully we can make a tainted one. Fabulous. So let's test one on Paka. Will you give the serum a try? It should just do good things for you. Great. And then friendly test serum again, snake oil on Sapria. And then maybe ask Sapria for a crystal, you know? Well, who just passed out? Paka, oh, what are you doing, you crazy? Oh my gosh, what a character. Okay, she gave us some stuff. That's good, that's good. We got a socialite, platinum, and orange topaz. Now we're gonna mix a tainted serum. I'm really excited about this. Gossip about coworkers with Eliza Pancakes. Oh my gosh, there he is again. I wanna go chat with Raphael to see what his deal is but we gotta do this for work, I get it. So like, what do you think about Raphael? Do you think we should talk? And the robot's like, listen to your heart, Mint. Maybe you need to give both boys a chance. Yes! Mint did a fantastic job today. It won't be long before academic prestige and scientific achievements arrive. Mint has been promoted to technological innovator. We're crushing it, so now we're at level four five of the science skill. We need to have 10 breakthroughs. We're gonna invite some people to hang out at the current lot. Ooh, let's invite Sage. Weirdly, we're kind of friends. Lyra, I do wanna become better friends. Tobias, also we could be better friends with Raphael, our crush right now. Although Tobias, we find attractive too, so who knows? Hazel Obvi, um, Lavender Thorn. We're not really friends with, but I want to be friends with Lavender. And then, oh my gosh, Paka. I feel like we'll tell Paka tomorrow. We can't invite too many sims because not everybody's gonna fit on the couch. Let's cook something for everyone. Ooh, Italian meatballs. Let's like cook a little party size. Hey, you gotta get in like a cute outfit though. Ooh, maybe wear this. Everyone's coming in. We got Lyra here and of course Raphael. I guess they carpooled because they live together. And I think she lives with them too. He immediately walked up behind her and was like, hey, but he's a little bored. Oh my God, Paka is inviting us over. Paka, we're busy. Now I feel bad we didn't invite him. He keeps walking over to us. Oh my gosh, he's like all over us right now. And then Sage, of course, our, our twin. Okay, I'm gonna form a group here and everyone is going to watch it together. I think I'm gonna get like a couple more chairs. We'll do something like that over there. I think we should do this. For some reason, this kind of gives me the good vibes. Oh my God, she's eating meat again. What was I thinking? Oh my gosh, everyone's gonna sit down. Oh, Tobias sat down next to her before Raphael could sit down. Oh, there's not enough room for all of them. I knew it wouldn't be enough. Wait, can you scoot over? <gasps> she did, she just scooted over. Oh, Sage just insulted her. That was so mean. Of course you did, Sage. We were having a good thing going. Ask us personality type. Oh wait, that's a flirty thing? Oh, I didn't know that. Okay, she did it. She watched this TV premiere. I'm still learning about myself. Hopefully next time I'll have things figured out. Oh, he's still learning about himself. Were they arguing in the bathroom? <gasps> wait, she's super mad, Lyra. Oh my God, she just stormed out of the house. Why? Even Hazel's kind of mad. Why are so many of them angry? Lyra just came in. I don't know who she had a fight with, but they're having like a funny conversation. Oh my God. And then of course, Sage just insulted someone again. Sage. She's like, look at my muscles. I'm like, Sage, stop copying me. I thought we were chill. Why don't we brighten Lyra's day? I want us all to get along. And Sage is just like really coming for us right now. I want to get to know everybody in the house. Ask about her career. We'll talk to Tobias. Compliment his outfit. It's a really cool outfit, Tobias. She's not getting any pop-ups when Tobias is around though. I know she thinks he's cute. And immediately the, the conversation just was like kind of quiet around him. Versus when we're with Raphael, the conversation just flows. Hook up in bed. She just keeps wanting to hook up with him. Ask about his siblings. I am an only child. Oh my gosh, Mint this too. I'm sorry that I have to leave now. There's uh, this thing I will have to do. This was so great, but it's time for me to go home, says Raphael. I have some things to do at home. See you later. Thanks for having me hanging out. I'll talk to you later. And this was great, but I think it's time for me to go home. But Tobias is still here. Wait, Raphael is still here too. Wait, the boys stayed. This is so drama. Both of them stayed. I feel like Raphael was heading out and then he saw that Tobias was still here and he was like, oh, okay. And then he 
stayed and now <laughs> Tobias is leaving Raphael's still here. Oh my God, make a flirtatious joke. You're alone and together in the apartment. Oh, it happened. They got immediately some flirt going in. She's gonna do a little prank to him. Maybe he'll like it, maybe he won't. Oh, he's playful now though. Oh my goodness, okay. He liked it. Oh my gosh, Simpson never like her prank. Wait, he's laughing at her goofiness. Are we falling for him? She's straight going to bed. I didn't tell her to do that. She still has a guest here, but I guess Raphael's like, I'm gonna just watch TV. I realize I don't have a trash can. This one's kind of cute though. Maybe we'll put this one, we'll put it at the side of the house. We don't want it like very obvious, but there you go. Is he gonna leave? He's taking out the trash in the rain for her. That's like weirdly romantic. <laughs> Raphael, we flirted with him once and he's like, I'll take out your trash for you. I'm so conflicted right now. Cause I was like, I don't want the drama, but like also the drama. <laughs> I mean, like maybe what we saw isn't what we thought it was. No, it was exactly what we thought it was. And he's like chilling though, watching some TV, letting her rest. Okay, he says, thanks for hanging out with me. I'll talk to you later at 4.51 AM. All right, now she's gonna play. Hopefully she'll get some. <gasps> Oh, uh, the storm kind of had a crash at the same time as this message, but it says from Raphael Williamson. Wait, no, I waited too long. It said, hey, beautiful. And then it said some other things that I didn't get to read it. Oh no. He said, I couldn't stop thinking about you. What the heck? They just kind of kept gravitating towards each other. I had the guy there. I didn't like help, but I did make her talk to the other guy too. And she just wasn't going up to him or having as many like positive reactions. It feels like every time she sees Raphael, there's like something crazy going on. But whenever she sees the other guy, it's just like, eh. okay, but back to work. Go read something. Hopefully you will get a little breakthrough from reading. She has to ask a coworker for a medal. Maybe she should ask Raphael. I don't know. Come on girl get a breakthrough okay that took like way too long to be honest <laughs> Raphael is here okay we're gonna go ask him for a medal she's like gonna walk all the way across the building passing several co-workers that could give her a medal in order to ask specifically her crush if he can have metal that she could use he's like hey they gave each other a hug they give each other hugs whenever they greet each other it's so cute they were friends first which is very cute okay he had one just lying around so let's upgrade what is it mind control change outfit oh she could prank Raphael for real with that she upgraded Ray the Ray has been upgraded and then we can invent the cloning machine oh we need another medal Hazel do you have a medal for me please oh she's sad why is she sad check on Hazel is she okay and then we can invent the cloning machine but we need to ask her if she's okay I'm all right Mint. I just have some things I'm dealing with thank you for checking on me and now she's happy oh good job Mint. She's such a good friend. Now she's inventing the cloning machine. Wow. Okay, we got to clone a plant. Clone object. Oh, it works. Clone the serum now. This is so cool. Now we have to invent the satellite dish, but we need three metals and three crystals. So we're gonna ask her for four different things. And then we're gonna ask someone else for the last two. As usual, Mint is very hungry while she's at work. I can't blame her. The last thing she had to eat was like mac, mac and cheese last night. Oh, she wants to eat a Fox BLT sandwich. All right, I'll let you. You better hurry up though. Is Raphael still in here? He is. He just happens to be here. So I guess we need to ask him for the other stuff. Be flattering, go talk to him. Why did she put her food down and where? Oh my gosh, Hazel just grabbed it. Dang it, Hazel, you stole my food. Ask for reassurance. Wait, is he asking for that or is she asking for that? And why? They're like having a little intimate moment over here. Do you consider me someone that you can trust? Oh my God, what is he gonna say? No, Min? Wait, what? Why? Okay, that was weird. Wait, why can't you trust me? I bet he has trust issues. I bet he is getting scared because he caught some feels for Min. We know he's been a little bit of a of a playboy before. Now he's all, mm, 
I can't possibly, I don't, you know, I don't trust you. And she's like, okay. You owe me a crystal because you grabbed my food, okay? Yes, now she can invent the satellite dish. Like two inventions and an upgrade all in one day. She's been crushing it. I'm gonna have her cook a garden salad family party size. If anyone wants to come over here, I think the maid is stealing money from my drawer, but she won't admit to it. I just want her to come clean. Do you think I'm just being paranoid? Yes, I do think you're being paranoid. Oh my gosh, why are you calling me about this Eliza Pancakes? I just think this rug is a little small. Maybe we'll get a bigger rug. I love the fox fur rug. Ooh, we could get more plants. I think I just got some custom content plants actually. Yes, I got all these new custom content plants and I totally forgot about them. Get me more plants. Oh, that's cute there. Oh, maybe like by the window, that'd be cute. And then there's even more of these too. So we could put like one next to the other one. Today, I do want to clog more drains and be more mischievous. So maybe we should invite ourselves over to the Impeachishme residence. They've invited us over a couple of times now and we haven't hung out with them. Having like a little breakthrough. So maybe we should have her read a book. Oh, did she have it? Yeah! Oh my gosh. <gasps> It's me, Raphael. Do you want to go on a date? Oh my gosh, Raphael. We flirted with him one time and he's already asking her on a date. Okay. Wait, we didn't go. I thought we would have already been going. Oh my gosh. Is there like a glitch where I'm not going to these things? We didn't go. So why don't we ask him on a date and pretend it was the date that he asked us on. And then we could always go on a date with Tobias as well, just to try to keep it even. Did he not accept your date? That was an awkward conversation conversation. Wait, did he just ask her out and then he didn't accept the date? I'm kind of confused. It feels like he's giving us the runaround. That or this game is glitching. I don't know which it is. <laughs> Let's go visit the Impeachishmays clog their toilet and then we'll maybe visit one more and clog that toilet as well. As soon as we reach level 10 of the mischief skill, we will have completed. Oh my gosh. And Simeon's here, who's apparently married to Chelsea now. Oh my gosh. So weird. I want you to knock on the door and go inside the house. Go clog the drain. Brielle was like, this is inappropriate. Brielle, how did you even know this was happening in here? And then Mintha's like, what? I'm playing a video game. Nothing to see here. Oh my gosh. They've got a home gym and it's all Live. Oh my gosh, Charlie. I'm not gonna lie. Charlie could be a good boy for us. That feels a little weird. I feel like we shouldn't become Impeachishme related because I feel like they're all gonna have a bunch of more kids and then eventually we might need those kids when my kids start dating. So maybe we shouldn't already mingle in that family. Let's go to the is it love or is it hate family? I feel like there's another guy there that she hasn't met yet. So like maybe Raphael is the right one. Maybe we should wait and see if someone else comes along. So let's talk to Luke. Luke shows sign of the Jester personality type. He's got a very cute face. Does she like him? Scope the surroundings, Mint. Anybody? Oh, after Mint scoped the room for attractive faces, she knows the one that sparked her interest. So Luke has sparked her interest. Let's see how she feels about Luke. Opens his profile. Just attractive. She perceives him as attractive, which she also see Tobias is extremely attractive, but Raphael, she seems is extremely attractive and is a love interest of hers. So she is more into Tobias than she probably would be into Luke. All right, clog the drain up here. Oh my gosh, no, 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 no. Luke is coming up and he's like, no, this is inappropriate. Oh, he caught her. No, I need the drain clogged. It's like, what the heck? Since he already doesn't like us, let's uh, do some little mischief stuff. <laughs> She just farted in front of him and he hated it. Oh my gosh, it seems like he's flirting with his roommate actually in front of us. So I don't think he's for us. He liked that one though. Lie about career, invite to a fake party. She's just messing with him and still in with false confidence. Ooh, Hazel says romance festival brings good luck. Want to find out if it's true. Okay, let's go. Wait, I couldn't go to that either. That just happened and it didn't work. This is why I'm thinking we should still give Raphael a chance because I truly think my game is actually glitching out and I don't know how to fix this. So if you know how to fix this glitch, please comment below. So let's invite, oh, Sage, honestly, you're dead to us. Lyra, we have a pretty good relationship. Tobias, we're gonna invite. Raphael, we're gonna invite. And then obviously Hazel who just asked. I don't know. They're all at this romantic 
festival together. Raphael's here. We're here. Let's see, why is Chelsea's silver sweater naked at the romance festival? Chelsea, put some clothes on. Raphael's not feeling well. Oh my gosh, are you okay? Joke about getting together. <laughs> they all laughed at him. Oh shoot, I should not joke about getting together. Wait, he liked it though. Oh my gosh. Let's talk to Tobias, okay? We never give Tobias a shot. Throw some petals at him. Mention the flirty festival vibe. See what comes up. No, Eliza, we don't want to hang out right now. Wait, is he jealous? Raphael's like still trying to be a part of the conversation. Wow, what a sim. Mintberry just stopped what they're doing around Tobias Ryder. This man has so many qualities that makes Mint hearts race. If they were a cross country marathon, their handsome features beat Mint's desires so readily that it's almost as if whatever created such a sim sculpted him specifically for them. Wait, she's really vibing Tobias now too. But wait, why did Tobias just leave? And now Raphael's talking with us. She wants to ask someone to go steady. Maybe share your insecurities with him. Be like, I don't know if I can trust you. You've been kind of up and down. You've asked me on a couple dates and then we like didn't follow through. She's cold. Don't wear this outfit then. Wear a warmer outfit, girl. Change into not nude. Don't be a Chelsea. All right, we're gonna change into like our normal clothes. Why is she mad again? Oh my gosh, Lyra's always mad. I really feel like she's jealous. I don't wanna be like this. I wanted to be chill with Lyra. Be like, Lyra, listen, like I don't wanna be in competition with you. If you've got a thing with him, you should just go for it. I'm gonna talk to Tobias. Bias. This is Chelsea's husband, Simeon. And she's like, hey, Simeon. Liking what you see? Oh my God, I hate it. Mint is being flirty with Tobias. Career. I'm gonna just let them talk. I haven't let them like sat with each other before. They are both feeling flirty, but that's probably because of the drinks. He's a serious musician. Ooh, that's kind of cool. Musician Tobias. I could have woohoo with you forever, said Mint. Mint, why would you say that? And then, of course, Lyra's coming to sit down in the middle of it. Is Lyra just trying to hit on every guy that Mint is interested in? Like, my gosh. Here's the thing. If Lyra was interested in Raphael, wouldn't she be with Raphael right now? Oh my gosh, Chelsea, don't sit down at the table naked. But that's my point is like, if she was interested in Raphael, wouldn't she go sit with Raphael? Thank you, Chelsea, for finally changing. She's just kind of hovering over Mint. And then whenever Mint starts a conversation with someone, she kind kind of starts getting into it. She wants to go ask someone to go study though. And she's feeling very flirty and he's feeling very passionate. Oh, they did just flirt with each other. I will say Raphael and her have had some really cute moments. Okay, wait, we got to do the ultimate test. We'll do the very same what's that spot interaction and we'll see if he vibes it. If he likes it, he might be for her. If he gets mad, he's not for her. It didn't bother him, but like he also didn't react whatsoever. I can't tell if it's just because he's still flirting. Look at her just walking in between us. Did he like it? Wait, are you okay, dude? He just stood there staring at her. He like didn't react at all. Ooh, but she's level seven, the mischief. Okay. He didn't react negatively, but he also didn't really react positively either. I'm getting mixed signals from Mint. I'm getting mixed signals from both of the boys. Let's just get them into like a conversation, ask about his love life, and then just see how things progress with Mint. Look at her. She's just watching them. Now she's not even chatting with Tobias at all. Ask about his love life. I need more more data. I don't know in between the two who we should go with. Look, he keeps walking away. Why do you keep walking away, Tobias? He's not even paying attention to her. Okay, now he's sitting in front of her. I need to find his traits. What are his traits again? And then he just walked away again. Raphael, I have no idea where he went. Oh, he's just passed out. He must have been tired. Let's go wake him up and see how he is. Oh, he just woke up. How are you doing, buddy? I'm just gonna click one interaction with them and see if they act the same way that the other guy did with her. Now she's immediately happy with him. And now he's pleasant and they became good friends. Okay, this is the thing, all right? I know there were a lot of Sims around, so maybe Maybe that had something to do with it. That like Tobias kept getting like pulled into other conversations. But like these two just vibe. It's just like easy. I'm not even, my hands are up here. Oh. Did she just ask him about the relationship? And then he just said, I don't know exactly how I feel about us right now. Oh. Raphael and Tobias kind of feel like not the vibe. I don't, oh, now I don't know. The romance went really far down. They were really early on and Mint kind of put him on the spot by asking that. She's very direct. I love that for her. You know what? I just want to see something. Who are you attracted to? I like platinum hair color. Wait a second. That's not what we have at all. Let's do like a simple flirt and see what happens. I am literally literally so confused right now. Honestly, I don't know. I'm going, I'm going to have her go home. It's like really, really early in the morning. It's been like 
2.30. She is super tired. Everyone else has gone home, essentially. I have no idea what to do about this. She has such a crush on Raphael, though. But then she also had quite a crush on Tobias. Let's go to sleep. And I think I might leave this here. We'll have one more day of the weekend to maybe work on some skills and maybe decide who we might want to go on a date with in the next episode, officially. We are, I think, about halfway through this first generation. Let me know if you're enjoying uh, this series in the comments below. Also, if you want to see generation two, make sure that you are watching every one of these videos so that I know that you guys are enjoying it. And I guess we'll decide who wins Mint's heart and who will be Mint's boyfriend in the next episode. Bye everyone!